school basketball team in the nation. We're just west of Indianapolis in Brownsburg and our first quarterfinal of the day in our boys. This one will meet either the three seed prolific prep or the six seed link academy tomorrow in the semifinals. Top seed in this event, Malou Paul the sixth in the white. First quarterfinal at Chipotle Boys Nationals is underway. Paul the sixth is the timing may be off a little bit. They've done a lot of scrimmage. Scrimmaging, nice move inside. And Roots with the tip in. Boy, bullied his way. Paul the sixth. McCarty, no. Offensive rebound, Roots. And Acuff trains the three for a five. Garrett Sundra, no. Sundra headed to Notre Dame. Cole Serta, his future college teammate, with a pull up three. And on ESPN in mid January, they have won 13 of 14 coming in. Hammond finally pulled the six on the board, and that's a and competitor. They cup the kick. Ruths knocks down a three. The third triple here in the first. Immaturity, as Sean McAloon said. Uh, and then the intensity started to go down, but now it's picked up. Freeman fading and hit. Loose ball corralled by Smith. Six to shoot. Harris tees it up. And Smith with another offensive rebound. Boy, you love Jordan Smith. Basket, because right now Paul the Six has not made many shots from the outside. Extra pass from Serta, and the three's knocked down by his shooting for the last month. Can I Roots can make that? IMG is a different team. Ben Hammond with an answer for Paul the Six. Jordan Smith pulls the trigger. And Gongbo with the offensive board. Open look for Harris, and he buries it. Just a minute. Feed Gongba. Here comes the double team. And Gongba sweeping out of it. And he puts it on that play. Impressive mobility. Again, coming off foot surgery as McCarty curls it home for IMG. Basis, you go to a school like IMG or any of these schools in the EYBL Scholastic or Paul the Sixth or Columbus. Kareem Stack. Here's Freeman, one of the nine McDonald's All-Americans we have in the tournament this year, and he hits the turnaround. He's going to go to work. Freeman says Syracuse has always been his dream school. And Abraham is headed to UConn. Freeman again in that area, opposite side of the floor against Abraham. And how about the touch again? What do you control and knocked it down? Impressive. See his ranking now inside the top 20 in the class. Sundra right down the shoot. Take over. Uh, won the Peach Sham Championship. He continues to make improvement throughout the course of his career. Jordan Smith knocks down. And can he maneuver out of it this time? Yeah, nice dribble out and pass over. Smart play. Smith drills the triple. Smith with the deflection and the steal. Numbers for Paul the sixth. And Darren Harris up over Acuff. Acuff, a blur. And swatted at the rim. It's a goal 10. The best thing Sean McAloon did for Darius Acuff, he told him the truth. And when you tell someone the truth, you make them better. Harris, that's pure. Offensive board by Amari Allen. Acuff. And Ruth's with the tip in. Well, that and Harris can't pay it off. Got it back, though. And Jordan Smith hammers in town. Finally, Paul the way to Rhode Island. Abraham. Bullseye. That's a three. Takes a few minutes to get it all out. A cuff, the kick. And Freeman with the triple. So Freeman. Coming off the McDonald's All-American game Tuesday in Houston with nine. Abraham, back-to-back -back three. Couldn't finish. No, great action by IMG to the elbow and the back cut. Hammond cut off and fouled. The 4-5 matchup with Luhai and Columbus. Cameron Boozer, VJ Edgecombe, Darren Harris. Feeling it. Jordan Smith, the sophomore, also with nine points for Paul the sixth. Inside Ruths, and he's got a dozen. See the ranked players for Paul the Six against Smith, top 10 in his class as a sophomore, and Darren Harris, a rank. Harris comes up with it. He's always in attack mode, Darren Harris. Pulling up, give it to him, back-to-back -back triples. Acuff the floater, rattles in. 
I like the play by Ake like he is right now. You have to take away his airspace, get a little bit closer. He dropped 40 in the game. Had a 52-point game in Shire. He says, it was always my dream school. And he says that Shire has come. And Donnie Freeman against his summer teammates, a team takeover, one of them Garrett Sundra. Freeman is on his way to Syracuse. He is the highest rated guy who can do everything on the floor. He has the profile, long and athletic. January. Yeah, he was in the late 30s, moved inside the top 20, and was named the McDonald's All-American. Abraham with a strong take. It's all big. Bank it in. He's always had the upside, Donnie Freeman. Now he's putting the upside with the productivity. And you love Ben Hammond. Now, if you got a little guac on the side, that's making it spicy. <laughs> Can I Roots? Oh, he flips it in. Who hit the three to force the IMG timeout? And good defense from Acuff. Abraham, look what he found. Down in this quarter. Acuff hasn't shot it well all day. Maybe that'll help. Gongba back on the floor, and he's got his second bucket. To hang with the big fella. Listed at 250 pounds on that 6'11 frame. Donnie Freeman. Uh, what a huge third quarter Darren Harris has put together. He's got 11 in the period. And an offensive foul now. Genius. <laughs> Don't know about that. She is a first grader, loves shapes and math. Oh, Darren Harris loves some math too. Have to do something to break that rhythm. Get a little tougher on the ball. Help each other out more. Now Harris, the elevation. G's got to really get connected defensively, and they're going to get blown out. On the run, Abraham feeds Gongba. You know, run at the moment as Acuff misses another three. They'll be like Connecticut with a 30 and 0 run against Illinois. No, it's a 12 nothing run. Defensively, there's a lot of talk with Paul the Six in terms of reigning champion, not exactly a defending champion because it's a brand new team. And Abraham, too strong. Paul the Six made a bunch of good cuts. Oh, the quick hands. Ben Hammond with an easy two again. Not and here comes Hammond again. Garrett Sundra to the top floor. Harp on the offensive end. Roots fouled by the committee, but they can hoist some hardware tonight just nope. across town. Yeah, what a venue, Hinkle Fieldhouse. Donnie Freeman, the McDonald's All-American, lays sensibly. How about this? Paul the Sixth just committed its first turnover of the game, and Donnie Freeman back-to-back turnovers for the Panthers. And Amari Allen, Acuff with the putback. Good job with the press. Paul the six calling a timeout after a quick 5-0 burst for IMG. And Darren Harris with his first points of the fourth. Tempo of the game started to change. So what happens is you got to talk about being tough. Get to your spots and attack. There he is, Acuff on the attack, and he draws the foul. I might count that. They will. It's a goal. To one thing. Second look there. I'm with you. I think that was a block. Now Jordan Smith. Clear the runway. Nobody's going to block. 11 for the sophomore. And Acuff puts it in the basket this time. Jordan Smith rocks the rim again. And five guys or six guys, you need eight or nine if you're going to be effective. Freeman money. Boy, Donnie was trying to put the knockout punch in. ABC Saturday, NA, the Florida Panthers. Coverage beginning at 12.30 Eastern. Love go those names. You're too young. <laughs> Terry O'Reilly. <laughs> I know who you're talking about, at least. <laughs> Cole Serta trades the three. You right. heard him, G. Uh, I've seen highlights, just like kids today watching Jordan. Here's another highlight for Paul the Six. To shoot the technical free throws for IMG. Let's take another in a moment. You're all about the rules, aren't you? Well, you're not on the highway. You're going 85 <laughs> in a 55 mile an hour. Hey, when freeway. I hey, my stars for that. <laughs> yeah, I'm your Uber. 
Numbers for IMG, Serta, a three. At the time, they have Sir Muhammad coming out of North Carolina. Terrific class for the Irish. Lead down to 14, but Abraham, Serta. Got it back, launching again, and he hits this time. I mean, he's got a deep. Has great chemistry and leadership. Uh, they're not gonna give this back. Ben Hammond at NC State. Guy that size who had the biggest heart on the floor. And I could never back down from anyone else, could make threes, and this guy is the exact same thing. And Hammond, oh, I thought he was gonna serve it up to. Bruce had a good first half, disappeared here in the second, but he gets the turnaround. Harris matched up against Amari Allen, a four-star junior, and Harris is fouled. This guy is 80-plus percent from the first. Losing in on the Chipotle Nationals single game to go here. Harris with 30. 12 freshman of the year had 34 in the quarterfinals a year ago with Link Academy against Paul VI. Serta puts it in. I mean, he's mentally tough. You're going to Duke next year. Recruiting class in 2024. Of course, see Cooper plus the timeline together. Seven to shoot. Abraham fires, and he connects. When you have leads, you don't lose games with Ben Hammond. Cole Serta with a deep three. They're gonna they got play. him. Yeah, they're going to play with great skill. They want to space the floor. They want time and space. He's going to knock it down. He knows how to finish games. Does at Maryland. Doug McDaniel is at Michigan on his way to Kansas State through the trans. He may want to use them for other ideas. <laughs> hey, after Riley Leonard left for Notre Dame, could use somebody at quarterback. Cole Serta with another three here. The oh, Hammond got knocked down. <laughs> And Darren Harris with a capper. Olivier Ryu is in here at the end for IMG. It's 7-7, the world's tallest teenager. But today belongs to Darren Harris and Paul the Sixth. 36 from the future Duke Blue Devil. Kept looking for his shots. He made it off the catch. He made it off the bounce. But he showed his leadership. You know, he showed his determination.